the format of being robot. Black zones are mysterious, expansive places which possess a very eerie vibe when first entered. The first documentation of these black zones appeared on June 6, 2019, after multiple users on the Roblox forums started a thread regarding their venture into these black zones. The criteria for an individual to end up in these black zones is unknown, but using the current evidence the community has gathered, it is known that users can end up in these expansive zones randomly at any given time. Most of the users caught in these zones were in games which either had too many players or too few players. When first entered, the user itself acts as a light source, allowing easy navigation through the black zone, despite anything within more than 20 studs being shrouded in black fog. There does not seem to be much, but certain users have come across the following. A blossom tree, except all the blossoms have turned black and is void of any feature. Debris from what can be seen as plain wreckage. Japanese text, made using actual parts rather than text decals, the only known texts found, thanks to the help of Google Translate, that have been found are, the children fell once the green troops came, and, the red rays have finally collapsed. One anonymous user speculates that this may refer to the Nagasaki and Hiroshima bombings, alongside the Troubles, which was a conflict in Northern Ireland from 1960 to 1995. Basic stone shrines with not too many depictable features. Tendril growth from the ground, appears static. Further insight, there seems to be nothing that would typically chase or terrorize the player, which would be seen in a cliché spooky place. The player is completely alone, with the only sound being the footsteps of said player. Users have tried finding the end of these black zones, but it was recently discovered that the zones are seemingly infinite. Some users have also mentioned areas in which they took damage in gradually. The creator of the black zones is unknown, as you can no longer access the black zone again using the recently played tab, making it very difficult to trace the creator. Some have speculated this to be an easter egg, whilst others theorize these to be the result of failed games. It's been rather difficult to link the message of these places to the atomic bombings of World War II, aside from the plane debris. The tendril growths are probably the most out of place feature in the black zones, as they appear as organic textured and certainly do not link to anything. One user said it could be symbolic of Slender Man, a popular fictional creepypasta, but this was later disregarded as there wasn't much to back up this claim. Recently, certain anomalies have been discovered. These anomalies range from something as simple as random ambience at certain periods of time, laughter from children. This was found to be linked to a royalty-free sounds website, which is quite odd, and notes at the possibility that the black zones might as well just be the creation of a user rather than something paranormal. And lastly, users caught in these zones have reported a feeling of being followed. Myth hunters have went ahead to question Roblox themselves regarding the black zones, but strangely enough, a developer from Roblox said this. We will look into four exploitations responsible for teleporting users into dark web chat rooms. Seven minutes later, this was deleted, and the user whom asked about the black zones was never to be heard of again, alongside the developer. But the strange thing is, there was a mention of dark web chat rooms. This leads to a theory proposed by a user who wishes to remain anonymous for personal reasons. The theory outlines the idea that these black zones are an attempt of some sort to establish a link between a surface web version of Roblox, and a dark web version of Roblox. It isn't known why this link would be made but some would see this as malicious intent, or perhaps an even darker, more sinister purpose that may not involve murder or torture, but regarding the age group of Roblox, something far worse that nobody should dare think of. The only question left regarding this possibility is that, why do the black zones visually appear as they do if they are a sort of link between the surface web and dark web versions of Roblox? Why not a conventional not so nightmarish appearance? We may never know, or perhaps we might as well be very, very close to an answer. When users who were previously caught in the black zones were questioned by others, including those investigating the black zones, some said that out of the corner of their eye, they would see something dash by. But one interesting user, Yellow Mellow 46 we may or may not disregard skepticism, but he claimed he felt a presence in the real world. Perhaps we, 
as in anyone from the entirety of Roblox including anyone with bad intent, may not even be responsible for the creation of the Black Zones.